So when I think of Connie, I think of family services. She is family services to many people in the community. Coming from a healthcare and a business background, I had to quickly learn how Connie works, that she and her staff work from their hearts. This is a wonderful thing until you have to make or you're faced with difficult decisions due to the lack of resources. Let's just say that we were not always on the same page. While Connie was out advocating for her clients, looking for new programs to help improve their lives, the board had, very, had some very hard decisions to make, such as cutting programs or decreasing staff hours. We always managed to figure it out together. Connie was willing to listen and worked with the board to educate them on the programs and prioritize the needs of those clients in order to maintain quality programs and vi viability of the organization. It will be very hard to fill Connie's shoes. She has put so many long hours into family services. She has given her heart and soul to providing high quality services to her community. She will surely be missed, but deserves to enjoy her time now with Jerry and her family. Good luck, Connie. Enjoy your retirement. And those grandkids, I am sure they are already thinking about what they can do to keep you busy.